idea. It's a great idea. Okay, so uh, that's Cooper's uh, official IKEA slogan, which is totally not anybody else's official IKEA slogan. Um, we have a car dealership here in town called Peak Kia, and their commercial says Peak Kia, it's a great idea. And somehow Cooper has associated that with IKEA now, and so every time we're talking about coming to IKEA, that's what he says. IKEA, it's a great idea. Yeah, he loves coming to IKEA because he gets to hang out in the kids' club. So I'm technically too tall for it, and I didn't really like it in the first place. So yeah, there were. <laughs> When Presley was little, maybe a little older than Cooper, she hated the IKEA Kids Club because there were rules. Like they were sort of strict about the things you could I do and you couldn't fun. do, and Presley was not at all happy having to follow the rules. Honestly, you couldn't move faster than this or you'd get yelled well, at. No, that's not true. Yes. What were the rules that you hated? Um, well, you couldn't, like, you had to be standing in the ball pit. You had to be standing, no sitting. I think there was sitting, maybe. You couldn't lay down in it, which is what I do in ball pits all the time. You couldn't lay down in it. You, you can't run or... Or at, I, I usually just walk pretty fast in the first place, so I had to go pretty slowly, which was annoying. And also they had this kind of sloped thing, and you couldn't slide down it. You had to kind of walk down it, and I'm like, why? <laughs> it's a sloped thing. you got to slide down it. Yeah, so it's a constant point of contention about the uh, the overbearing rules of the IKEA Kids Club that Presley couldn't stand. So whenever we came, Presley had to, had to go with us and do a shopping. Today she's got to do shopping because I guess we should tell you, we're, uh, we're going to start a new... Uh, education series and so we're gonna build a new set and sort of do everything up and make it all kind of a, a more structured and, and formal looking uh, education series and also I'm too tall for there anyway so. hey, well I am Presley's too tall to go in the club. so um, today we're buying some stuff for the set IKEA is a great place to get some of that stuff uh, but we do need help uh, you'll see us we'll start putting some stuff together downstairs tonight and you'll see some of that coming up but we're gonna need some help with some names we're trying to come up with a name for the new series uh, I think Presley's current favorite is Professor P Yes. Right, which we use for some of our education stuff. So we could do, if we called something Professor P, would you guys like that? Uh, do you have other suggestions for what we could call an education? Because it'll probably include a lot of different stuff. It won't just be science. There may be some history. There may be some of the Japanese stuff. We may just sort of segment some of the education stuff off and do a different uh, area uh, with its own name. So if you guys have name suggestions, we'd love to hear it. Um, we'll show you some of the set that we're building, and, and we've got some stuff ordered online that will that'll be in you know, over the course of the week that we'll show you as we're kind of building out and getting ready for it. We're pretty excited about it. But uh, let us know if you have any suggestions. Also, content, like what kind of educational stuff do you think would be cool for Presley to do? Yeah? yeah. What do you think? Um, yeah, definitely give suggestions for what we're working on. Uh, we don't have too much of a idea about what we're going to do, so any suggestions are definitely welcome. Cool. All right, so let's go hit IKEA and uh, see what we can find to build this set out. Okay, slight change of plans. Uh, Kids Club is full. Uh, they're pretty busy on the weekends here, so Cooper's going to go with us. But he loves these little carts because you win these carts. Ready, Cooper? Ah! They do pretty nice spinning around. All right, you want to hold the camera? Yeah. Here, hold it. Reach out like this. Hold right there with that hand. And hold right there with that hand. Okay, don't push any buttons. Hold it just like that so it's on your face. Straight, straight arms. Okay, ready? It's on your face. Just don't let go. Keep it pointed straight at your face. You ready? Cooper view! This is one of the things that I came for. I saw these on Tumblr and they're absolutely amazing. Uh, they're little apples and you tilt them and they light up. Uh, but just, they, these like display ones don't seem to be working right now. But I've seen them before and they're really cool. So glow apples. And they're only $1.99 because apparently they're getting rid of them. But apples. science chashkis. Um, so if you guys have any ideas for the science chashkis, then please put them in the comments below. Um, we still definitely need ideas to fill this up. Okay, so this is cool. Somehow, like, Mommy knows all the secret doors in Ikea. And so we, like, weave around and go through, like, employee-only areas and, like, crazy stuff. When her Mommy, like, does, like, a little, uh, you know, beautiful mind, you'll kind of say, okay, how do we get to this area? And Mommy will go, Z -Z -Z, like, her eyes will roll back up a little bit and she'll just, just calculate the path and be like, this way. And then she Lewis and Clarks us all the way through the secret doors. It's pretty cool. Okay, we're going to show you one of Mommy's secret paths. Go ahead, Mommy. Okay. Go, through go straight. We'll follow you. We're gonna go through the rug area. And then over into the bathroom area and sneak out. Cool. Here's our second little back path. See? Our rug's going that way. I see what's inside. We sneak out this way. That's 
can't even see added, that there's a door back here. And it's kind of here. You slip back through and you're in the plant area. Fake plant and real plant. And then suddenly you turn the corner and doo -doo -doo, Indiana Jones. All right, let me grab one of these. So you're in full on, uh, you know, Indiana Jones, uh, what's the Ark of the Covenant warehouse uh, in here to pull, pull stuff. All right, so I gotta put this down because I gotta go pull furniture we're pulling. I don't know how we're gonna get the stuff in the car. That may be a huge part of the vlog too. See how we get this stuff in the car, but we'll see what happens. We're getting the last one, the red desk. And we're doing a cool Ikea, like build your own, like buy the desktop and buy some legs and uh -huh. stuff. Cool. Yeah, so Abba's down by the legs. Okay, and we got legs for the table. Legs. And Cooper's about done. <laughs> I want to eat. Yeah, I think everybody's ready for lunch time. We might have PF Chang's, and I'm very excited because I really like PF Chang's. We'll see and neither my dad or my mom will need to edit this. So, and it takes a long time for my parents to edit, so it's going to take a long time. I'm for for our next video. Are you gonna leave mommy alone and let her edit? I think so, I don't know. Okay, so it doesn't look too bad from back here, but hold on, let's see where the kids are. There's the uh, little kid cubby where we're smashing everybody in. I'm gonna squeeze in, hi mommy. There we go. So that's a lot of stuff to get in this little car. That's a pretty good, I'm pretty proud of that. We'll have to stand up before we leave and get a nice shot of the view. We can't really do it justice from here with the backlighting and stuff. But we're P.F. Chang's having a little uh, salt and pepper calamari, which is probably one of the best apps in the world. Definitely one of my favorites, especially. I really like it every time. Hey, Cooper, is it good? What do you think? What? I think everybody likes it. Mommy can eat it because she's gluten free, but that's more for the rest of us. So it's wah, awesome. Wah. Wah, wah. <laughs> the slogan for the new channel gonna be? <laughs> what size? Butt size. Butt size. Butt size. So we're talking about the new like education playlist thing having. Um, uh, like bite-sized learning with a bite-sized host for Presley to be hosting it. And so Cooper goes, butt-sized? You got a butt-sized lesson? And then he started going into biting butts. We said, no, bite-sized. And he said, bite your butt-sized? Right, are you being silly, Cooper? Yeah. You live with a little four-year-old boy. There's lots of butt humor going on. Hey, how many shirts do you have with butt on them? Two. Two, what do they say? The first one says, guess what, sit in butt. Yep. And the other one says, how do you do That's Cooper's thinking face. <laughs> says, like, eat pizza. Play video games. Kick butt. Kick butt. That's right. So, guess what, chicken butt and Newton Ninja Turtles kick butt. Loves his butt shirts. We'll be like in Joanne's Fabrics in line and he'll just tell the person in front of us in line, I've got two shirts with butt on them. We're gonna have a conversation about his butt shirts. So lots of butt humor going on in the house. So this is gonna be the location of the new set. Yes. And the IKEA furniture of the new set. Yeah. We've got the red table, which There's I think looks really good. Exercise. There's a chin up bar right there. I felt very accomplished because yesterday I actually jumped up from the floor onto that and I felt very, very accomplished because nice. <laughs> I had small. Um, so this was, we have this huge unfinished basement in the house, right? Yeah. Um, it's the whole size of the house, right? And um, when we bought the house a few years ago, we were thinking we would probably finish it and make something nice out of it, yeah. but it turns out that costs money, <laughs> um, which we don't have enough of to actually do that work. Yeah. And uh, so we were going to take like this plastic sheeting and hang it up and make rooms down here uh -huh. so that you we could kind of see how we wanted to lay it out and we could test some things out and see oh i like this or before we sort of had somebody come in and build walls yeah we were going to test it out right and this is the only thing i ever ended up doing mm -hmm. and i just put these sheets up because this used to be the ping pong table room yes. and i got tired of chasing ping pong balls all over the basement mm -hmm. 
And so I put this up to catch the ping pong balls. Yeah. But it turns out this is probably going to work pretty well for studio space. And then it turned into a workout space. So I had like the workout equipment and the chin-up bar and the jujitsu dummies were in here. And we wrestled around with the yeah. jujitsu dummies. And so uh, we cleared all that stuff out yesterday or last night. And now we're building some of this stuff. We're going to build the set back here. You guys will get to see all the uh, illusion of a set. It'll just be this, and we'll put a couple of things back here, and when you shoot the camera at the right angle, you won't be able to tell we're just in a dingy corner of the, corner of the basement. Yeah. Right? Um, like a background. Yeah, we'll put a background in this thing with tchotchkes and everything. It'll look like we're in a real room. Yeah. Nice lights. We'll kind of get it all working. What do you think, Cooper? Is this going to be a good place to shoot vlogs? Yep. Yep, this will be a new place. And then we may actually take one of the other walls down here and put our green screen up permanently. We've got like the white screen. Yeah. And so maybe we'll put a green screen up and maybe a black background so we can just shoot different things in different places. I think that'd be kind of cool. So we'll turn this into a nice shooting space. I mean, a uh, Good Mythical Mornings background is one that like... Uh, is really... Like the cabin thing? Yeah, and yeah. there's not actually a corner. It's like a painted mm -hmm. line that makes it look like a corner and I didn't figure it out. And then when I finally figured it out, I'm like... That's just a wall behind me. <laughs> There's a lot of magic that goes yeah. on in building one of these things. Yeah. So yeah, we're going to build this set out. Um, like we said early in the vlog, like we need some help. It's going to be an educational series, so what should we call it? Yeah. Do we stick with Professor P, or do you guys have any additional ideas, or do you have ideas? Like I said, this thing is going to be full of little science tchotchkes, and so if you have ideas about science tchotchkes that we can put in here, well, you can let us know. Yeah. We'll put, we'll shoot some more over the next couple of days as we get stuff set up down here so you can picture better yeah. kind of what it's all going to look like, and then mm -hmm. you can kind of chime in. Yeah, because yeah, right now it's just kind of this thing, a desk, and yeah. It's just a mess for yeah. a second. But hopefully There's we'll also better. a knife in the box. There's a knife in the box from when I was starting to cut boxes open. Yeah. So yeah, I think this is gonna, you know, I'll get this built tonight probably. Uh, we've got stuff on the way, the backdrop is on the way, some tchotchkes are on the way to put in here and stuff. So I think we'll probably, we go to Salt Lake City on Wednesday. <laughs> when we get back on Sunday or Monday, most of this stuff will probably be here and, and we'll plow forward. So yep. a week from tomorrow, we'll probably let you guys know what's going on with the set. Yes. Deal? Deal. Okay. Any other questions you have about the, the new uh, series? No. Mostly the name right now. Yeah. We need some help with the name. Once we get the name up and running, we're going to need to build like a new banner and some stuff like that. So if you guys have, uh, or a new intro kind of thing, or some in cards or something, if you guys uh, want to help out with that kind of stuff, that'd be pretty awesome too. Yeah. Cool? Yeah. All right. um, as well as we do have a lot of artists that um, have, that, like um, Tiger Paradise. There's quite a yeah. few artists that are following us. If you guys like to help out, please. Yeah, I'd um, love to have a, you know, a subscriber do some of the artwork for the channel. I think that'd be really awesome. Yeah. In fact. Uh, yeah, so I think that's pretty much it. That's been a big day, a big weekend, in fact. Like, yeah. I gotta go to work in the morning. I don't feel like I rested at all. Because <laughs> we did all that stuff, popping tags yesterday for yeah. getting ready for the interviews and the con and stuff. Uh, today, we made the Ikea run, had a nice lunch, that was nice. Mm -hmm. And then I had sewing, we're trying to get a cosplay ready for Presley, yes. for uh, even trying to get it to Salt Lake. You guys will see that in a couple of days if we get it done. And then now, building all this stuff for the rest of the night, probably. Yeah. It's gonna be a long night. But Co Cooper's gonna help me out, so I think yes. it'll go pretty quick. <laughs> right, Cooper? Yeah. Okay. You want to say bye to everybody, Cooper? Yeah. Are you gonna do it up close? Are you gonna do it up close? Uh oh. Everybody, be prepared. Here comes Cooper up close. <laughs> Cooper close up. <laughs> Sneak behind. You. Good thing it's not 3D. <laughs>